levels, there is three difficulty settings. There's casual, which basically, as you see on the screen, there's a yellow line that guides you through um, through the map, and you have no control of... You get, you get the choice of what direction you want uh, with the arrows. Um, then there is a moderate and a expert um where you control where you go. So you have to control what direction by leaning on the board from left and right. Um, I don't know how to skateboard, but I got a couple of the kids here in the neighborhood to try it out, and they said it is very, it's too touchy compared to like a real skateboard mm -hmm. um, from what they said. Um, so trying to do all do all that, I tried it at an expert. You can do like the speed runs, which is a good fun uh I like those. You can do those, and those are fun to steer yourself. But trying to pull off tricks in a certain order while controlling, mm -hmm. it's just, it's too touchy. It's its just, it's not. Yeah. It's a little unfortunate. Yeah. It made we're me a little sad. We're not, 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 we're not there yet. Yeah. The, the only thing I could even say about this game is if you have a buddy who disagrees with us, who likes this game and thinks it's fun, and you find yourself in the mix of one of these parties where you're going to be playing it, you can have some fun with it if you jump in like I did. You know, Mike's already down here playing it. He says, hey, give this a shot. I'm thinking, you know, this is pretty cool. But to actually try to go through the game itself and right. actually try to, you know, beat this game and master it, I don't see it being and, much And of speaking a of game. the story mode and going through, they call it road trip, um, it's basically one challenge after another. Mm -hmm. Um it's it's the same thing over and over again, different venues. There's some maps. The maps are pretty creative. Um, I'll give them that. They did a good job of making, um, taking real places and putting yep. some stuff in there to grind some rails, to go through some like amusement park in Central sure. Park that doesn't exist. But <laughs> it, 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 it is pretty cool. Um, I didn't get to Tokyo to the last part yet. I just got too frustrated with it. I couldn't... I'm not that good of a gamer at it. It doesn't really exist. It's just on the box. They figured no one would get there. <laughs> no one would get there. Oh, so no one's ever going to get that achievement. Yep. Um, but other than that, it, I was I was a little disappointed. I was. Yeah, unless you are a hardcore skateboarder and you've been dying to get this game, I, I can't I can't see it being recommended. Even if you are, go get Skate. It's EA. It's with the controller. It's fantastic. Go get that instead. It's fun. And it's sixty dollars. It, not as a party game, though, I will have to say, watching other people play this game is a blast. Yeah, it's... yeah. Let's get to the, let's get to the couple pros. It's, it's a decent party game. One thing that they I'm saying is awesome. It is fun. The crashes are funny, man. They are so funny. If you yeah. as you're watching on the screen, oh, yeah. some of oh. these are ridiculous. But here we go again. I'm putting a con in again. Yeah. They cut it short. They don't let the body completely fall to the ground. I mean, it's so funny. Oh, it's yeah, like, this guy gets brutalized. Uh, <laughs> it's or, or like, lady. Or the lady. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, oh, oh man. boy. Yeah, that's sad when the highlight of a game is you failing to succeed at the game is yes. the best thing yeah. you can say about it. Um, in terms of Twin Galaxies here and world records, there is there could be some world records. Mm -hmm. Um so yeah. kudos to you if you want to go Good and get luck. them. Um, <laughs> obviously, we'll have the settings. Uh, give us some time, of course. Full testing of the game needs to go through. Um, obviously, this might be one where uh, you need a video camera to record yourself as well. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we think we're going to make Mike G do the testing. Yeah, I think it, make him do the uh, inaugural <laughs> runs Rock and stuff and like that. Yeah, but you can use it. You can do it with your hands. It's, I don't know if it's easier or not. Sometimes I thought it was easier. I'd be playing like this, you know. <laughs> and I, you could just basically flip the board around and get a whole bunch of extra points than you would standing on it. <laughs> it's like jumping off the power yeah, pad. But navigating it, going like this with your hands, just doesn't work either. So, Would we'll it be see. possible to screw four wheels onto the bottom of this? <laughs> that was actually one skateboard. of the prototypes had wheels on it. Really? They were just rooted to a piece of plywood. Go out there and look for um, Tony Hawk Ride prototype controllers hmm. on the internet, anywhere you go. You will find a big, huge write-up at several sites with a bunch of pictures of the things that were almost this game. Hmm. Huh. Hmm. They said, I'd like the concept, but... Some some kid would have killed Maybe themselves though. if they put wheels on this thing. Yeah. So I'm sure some kid's going to kill themselves on this thing. Uh, probably, I but, fell off. but I mean, you almost I, I wonder with the, with the wheels if their lawyers didn't just say, yeah, right, take yeah. the wheels <laughs> off that thing right now. And it's another thing, you need, you need some shoes to wear when you play this game. Yeah. Playing in your socks can only get you so far in the game. So, Nick, overall, what do you give this game? Score, 1 out of 10. Uh, a 6. I would give it a 7, honestly, but the $130 price tag is just too steep for me. Hmm. I'm going to go with the uh, I'm gonna go with a 3. Uh, the other stuff that's out there is just way too good. 
and the controls are broken at best. So yeah. three out of ten. Yeah, I'm gonna go six as well. Um, you know, I can't agree more with Nick. You know, um, game's fun, but for 130 bucks, no way. They said everything I wanted to say. <laughs> I give it a five out of ten, though. 